We're here with Eric Lee of Team Spades in the 2019 Best of South Tournament in downtown Atlanta, the Georgia World, Con World Congress Center. And Eric, the state of Florida didn't have June events for live period. Unlike a lot of other states, for you guys as a team, Floridians that are being recruited, what type of urgency did you come into this tournament with to really show that what the coaches well, didn't, just, didn't see? Well, just come out, play my artist since we didn't have a live period. We had events where we could go see coaches. Sure. They could see us like UCF, USF. But my team, my high school team ain't really do stuff like that, except for the USF and UCF tournament. But other than that, we, I came out here with our agency. I got, you know, I got offers. I still want to come out and get more as I sure. can of go out of my offers. You know, we've got about 200 schools here at the Best of South. How do you feel like you've played in front of all these coaches? I feel, I played good. I, I, I'm starting to play my game more, you know, like just physicality. I love, love the physicality, but uh, it's just playing in front of the coaches. I feel like I'm doing good, showing off what I can do offense and defensive-wise instead of just playing one side of the ball. You know, seeing you back at the Atlanta Jam in April to where we are now, where do you feel like your game's taking the biggest jump? Oh, see, my shooting. That's, I know in Atlanta Jam I wasn't really like shooting like consistently like I wanted to, but I ended up being in the gym the month of June and just working. And just putting up 500 shots a day, making 500, and just seeing what I can do. So when you're talking to these college coaches and they're seeing that improvement, what type of pitch are they making to you? What are they saying they like the most about your game? My effort, my athleticism, how I play defense, how I see the floor, my IQ, what I can do. Let's talk about those schools. Who has offered you up to this point? I have Ohio University, Stetson, Canisius, and Elon. And then up to... Obviously, you have schools that are recruiting that have an offer to you. Who falls in that category? Uh, you get UNLV, Moorhead State, Tulsa, Mercer, um, Western Michigan, FIU. And, uh, I think yeah, I think that's all. I got. Have you taken any visits? Any plan on visiting? Uh, yes, I took in, I took a visit to Elon. That's why I got my offer. I visited Stetson. Those are my. That's the unofficial unofficial visits. That's what I took. I uh, went to FIU for an unofficial too, and I'm planning to take like, all my officials during the school year so I can see what campus life is about. Yeah, what's going to matter the most when you start to really look at the big picture in recruiting? See if I can fit, and then if I can fit in this area and like it feels like home to me, that's perfect. And if I know the education is good, because that's the one thing my parents struggle on, they don't want me like going one and done. Right, they right. don't want me to get my education and have a Smart move. Yeah. Parents are usually right. Yeah. <laughs> What's uh, the staying close to home? Does that matter to you? You have a lot of schools that aren't in the area. Uh, I have a lot of schools that aren't in the area. Yeah. But like, I don't, I like, I'm not from Florida. I'm okay. from Vermont. Got it. So anywhere that's cold feels like home. Florida, I had to not get used to it. Not yeah. cold. But I got to get, I got used to it. But I'd love to stay home, play in front of my family, and just have fun. But if I would love to go out and explore the world, like more West Coast, sure. more Mid Coast. Well, Eric Lee and Team Space has certainly been hot here at the Best of South in downtown Atlanta. Appreciate your time. Best of luck the rest of the week. Thank you.